The Building Better Opportunity Getting Cumbria to Work project is funded by the European Social Fund and the National Lottery Community Fund. We've been in operation since 2017 and Cumbria CVS is the lead partner working with um, four other community-led organisations, so that includes Women's Community Matters, uh, Right to Work, CADAS and The Well Communities. We operate the project across Barrow and Furness in the South Lakes and we work with people 18 plus who are furthest from the labour market and experience complex personal difficulties and barriers to employment effectively. Some of the barriers our participants encountered have been childcare issues, um, access to IT and technology and how to use them substance misuse issues, mental health issues, physical disabilities and lack of qualifications. They seem to be the main ones that we come across quite a lot. We've paid for childcare to allow them to attend training courses. We've bought some of our participants' tablets and we've delivered training so they know how to use those tablets so they can search for a job. We've had some CV writing courses. Um, we've also done some workshops on how to actually search for a job. We've done some real practical things on how to use the internet. There's been some fantastic progress within these. So it's, um, yeah, it's really, really good. Given the right support and the right help, and the right encouragement, people can overcome barriers and, and obstacles in life. I know I did. I was at a place where I didn't know what I'm going to be doing next. I was a bit confused about the future. I was doing a PhD before having my little girl. And then after she was born, my priorities changed. So I wanted to discover what I could do next really important for me to do this job because I want to be able to help people to identify what they enjoy doing, what they're going to excel at, what are their assets, you know, how they can use that to overcome challenges. We deliver one-to-one -one support for each individual participant and the really good thing about the BBO is it's so tailor-made so it allows us to help our participants set their goals and then they can head towards one of the outcomes of education and training, job search or employment. So some of the activities that we have done um, through the BBO project have been really centred around health and wellbeing. We've had um, gong baths, participants really do enjoy them. We have yoga nidra, we've done mental health first aid, we've done health and safety in the workplace and it's really what the participants have said that they need and, and we build on that really. The project is so necessary to have seen it literally change so many people's lives. It gives people self-confidence, it gives people self-esteem. I absolutely strongly believe that people can change. Given the right support, I think it's priceless. The most recent courses that we've actually got signed our participants up to, one was a zoology course um, and we also helped another participant obtain his CSCS card and then he went on to complete and, and successfully finish a dumper truck training course. We have had some amazing successes through my time on the project. We've also had a participant who went to a workplace for some work experience and he did that well. He was actually offered employment. It changed my life in, in such a big way. Well, in the space of a year from when I started talking about the idea of working where I do and then actually going on to you know, maybe volunteering and stuff, and then the position actually coming forward. And because it was based around the idea of looking into getting into work and stuff, it felt like you were progressing all the time. The BBO made a massive impact on my life. I think I enjoyed knowing where I am going, so uh, drawing a path for myself both professionally and, and non-professionally, it's a kind of a self-development experience. They really supported me to first become an interpreter 
and also to set up my own business. The whole day is my favourite part of the day because I get up and I think to myself, wow, I've got a great job to go to. And then I get there and then it just gets better and better as the day goes on. And it's, it's, it's hard sometimes, but that's what makes it so brilliant. I've been living in Barrow and Furness for the past three years and I work as an interpreter thanks to the BBO project so I think I've, I've received a lot of support and I'm very thankful for that. It's an honour to accompany them on that journey and to really see these participants achieve the goals that they've set for themselves. And I'd like to take the opportunity to thank our key worker staff and all of our participants who have engaged with our wonderful project. We'd also like to take the opportunity to thank our grant officer Johnny Baldwin for all of his wonderful support of our project.